Hi guys, welcome to Hook Tools. My name is Jason Bethards and I'm here to show you a demonstration on how to drill fire sprinkler pipe. We This pipe says it's three and a half from there. Uh, we got a quarter inch pilot, bolt, pilot hole drill and if you push this button right here, this bar slides out. But if you put bring it back, look, it locks in by itself. So we're gonna push this button. We're gonna adjust it to where it sits over here. We want the hook just to sit right over there. First thing I'm gonna do, figure out where I want the hole. Okay, now I'm gonna look at it. Make sure I like it, it make sure it looks level. Okay, I do. So I'm gonna put, put it here, put the hook right there. And then with this hand, I'm gonna push down. See what it's doing to the hook? It's forcing this bit in, so watch. Watch how. Okay. So that's done. Now we're going to take the hole saw, inch and a half. We got the same thing. But this is the industrial version. This is what you want when you're drilling a lot of holes. Same setup. You got the button here, you push. Push it this way. When you do, they're open the hook up, see it? So we're gonna push the pilot in, and then we're gonna set the hook, and you lock it in right here with the button. So now look, pushing down right here with this. Look what it's doing to the hook. It's forcing it over the other side of the metal. Since this is a brand new bit, I'm not even gonna put much force because I don't wanna break the uh, pilot bit, so. Now it bottomed out, so I'm gonna reset it again. Right there. That was too fast. You do know that this is hardened steel and it is very hard to push. And the reason I know this is because I've uh, been drilling the steel a lot. I'm gonna take a file, clean the edges up. Okay, now we'll put this on. Uh, make sure the seals sit in place and the grooves. Put it on. And I'm gonna put my finger in there. And just make sure it's, uh, it feel all the way around. Take this bolt off. Put it in. Tighten it up. Now I'm feeling, make sure it's set properly. And I'm gonna get this tool, the impact, start pushing it down. I'm gonna look in there. Yep. Okay. So now I take my pipe here, put it in, and get a level on it. go all right There you go. That is how you install a mechanic tee. And what I've used was the hook drill. You see how fast it went through there? Ate it up like it was hungry for metal. I would like to make you one of these tools. I make them to fit on a cordless drill or this drill with a cord. The ones with the cords have a hinge on it. So you can open up and hook onto bigger pipe. Uh, they will not break. You're looking at solid stainless steel here. This hook was made at a factory, laser cut with uh, teeth on it, and it's also a concave. So the teeth will grab the pipe real easy. 
This is all stainless. Everything. So there's no rust going on. The hinge is um, not stainless. That's, that's the only thing that's not stainless. But everything else is. So this tool will last a long time.